family. I want to take you back for a second um, to when I was five years old. So we're talking 1990 here. <laughs> and um, yeah, just a little girl in a snowsuit, two skis doing the pizza cut. <laughs> um, the first place I ever learned how to ski, right here down the bunny slope. <laughs> um, Nick and I are doing our first day of skiing this season and we thought we'd share it with you, share the experience with you because I know it's reminiscent of some really wonderful family times together um, at Sugar Tree Phase 1. <laughs> um, yeah, it's been a good day so far. We've had a few runs in and now we're warming up with like a little hot cocoa, a little hot toddy. Maybe a little peppermint schnapps, who knows? <laughs> um, don't worry, Grammy, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm good. We're done skiing for the day. I wouldn't drink and ski, don't worry. Um, and then we're probably gonna hit up the outdoor hot tubs. So, we got some fun ahead of us. <laughs> all right, well, I was just thinking of you and I wanted to share this moment. I love you all. Miss you. Welcome to Sugarloaf. You guys can't do this down in Florida. I don't know if you guys hit me over the music, but... You guys are missing out on a good time up here. We miss you. Woo! <laughs> nice. Hi, family. So, it's a little late in the day. like close to four now. I'm only like three hot toddies in. <laughs> so things are feeling really warm. Um, I know it's not as warm as Florida here, but I'm warm inside and I'm warm thinking about my family. I wish, I wish we could be together this year, but I hope this video Last run of the day. The sun's over the clouds there. It's pretty beautiful. I don't know if you can see it through the trees, but there's the top of Sugarloaf over on the left. We're gonna stick over here on the right. This is our favorite trail. Since Tote Road. Tote Road, since they're not completely open yet this year. Ah, oh, babe, I'm so excited. I can't wait until we hit the hot tubs. That's my favorite mm -hmm. part. Ah. Oh. It's been a little blistery out today, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> it's no Florida weather, but we are about to enjoy a nice hot bath in the most amazing outdoor hot tub that I've ever been in. I think you might recall the place. <laughs> so I'll meet you there. We wanted to show you a little bit more of the main life, see if you're missing it at all. And uh, I want to say hi to Heather, Grammy B, Bob, and Karen. Merry Christmas. Hi, family. It's December 18th, 2013. It's probably less than 10 degrees outside, <laughs> but it's uh, 103 in this hot tub. Oh, there's ice underneath my arms. <laughs> um, but we're having a great time. And Beginning to look feel not like Christmas. Everywhere you go, take a look at the five and ten. Da 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 da. da, 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 da. And candy canes that glow. <laughs> All right, here I go. All right, she's jumping in. The snow. <laughs> Oh my God. I didn't think you'd do it. <laughs> That's cold. Oh, enjoy yourselves in Florida. Your little pieces of love you. Hello! We're just at our local 
off the egg and I, and I wanted to um, extend the happy holiday. Happy, happy holiday! holiday! Bring back the sunshine, will you? That's right, he'll be, he'll be back next summer, so oh, stay yeah. tuned. Yeah. Yeah. Hello, family. We're here at Kathy and Dave's, actually it's now May Lily's and Riley's, and um, I wanted to have some important people wish you a Merry Christmas. So, Hi Heather and Kara, and Barbara, we have a Merry Christmas, a very Happy New Year, and Heather, I hope your back is feeling much better. You take care of it. Hi, H. Barb, Karen, Bob. Hope all's well with you folks. Uh, I saw the news that Orlando was going to break a record today, 90 degrees. So I assume it's warm where you are. I'm jealous. <laughs> so Merry Christmas. And Hello, Grammy B. So, every time I see you, you request the same song. <laughs> and I would just like to perform a scene of Strangers in the Night so you, that you have it on film for years to come. Alright, and see. Strangers in the night, exchanging glances, wandering in the night. What were the chances we'd be sharing love before the night was through? Something in your eyes was so inviting, something in your smile was so exciting. Something in my heart told me I must have you. Strangers in the night, two lonely people, we were strangers in the night. Until the moment when we said our first hello, little did we know that love was just a glance away, a warm dance away and ever since that night we've been together lovers at first sight in love forever it turned out so right for strangers in the night hi everybody in florida i'd like you to meet my family hi i'm mark place i'm kim i'm lauren <laughs> Me. And I'm Nick. Have and a Merry Christmas, Christmas from, from the Blaze family. Sabers ring, are you listening? In the lane, snow is glistening. A beautiful sight, we're happy tonight. Walking in a winter wonderland. Walking in a winter wonderland. Hi, family. This next part is for Lucy Girl. Hi, Lucy. Hi, Lucy. Do you know where we are? Do you? All right, I'm going to put you down now. Okay. Love you. Oh. Hi. <laughs> Renovation, 50, $50 million renovation. 
Um, here's the view now. <laughs> the view hasn't changed, I guess, but the bar has. So we're gonna pan around and give you a little, give you a little sneak peek before you get home this summer. The new lobby. Decorated for Christmas. again. Lindsay, how do you feel like the film has gone so far? I'm feeling pretty good about it, Nick. Um, you know, we've, we had a list of all the places we wanted to film and we've, we've slowly been ticking them off. I'd, I'd say the only regret is not getting the video of Heather. Uh, we wanted to do a video re reenactment of Heather driving into that ditch at Saddleback. That would have been priceless, but you know, with these things, you and some, you lose some, and I think it's going pretty well. What do you think? Yeah, I think it's going pretty well. Um, I wouldn't want to actually get the car stuck, though. Me neither. That, that would make, it would make for a funny outtake, but probably wouldn't be laughing while it happened. Do you think it's going to be hard to be without your family this Christmas? You know, of course I love my family, and I know they love me, and... It'll be hard, but, you know, you can't let your emotions get the best of you in situations like this. Definitely not. We've been through so many things together, and it makes me really emotional to think that we won't be together on Christmas this year. And I hope this is the last year of many. Well, Lindsay, it didn't snow on Christmas Day, but there is snow on the ground. Are you glad it's white Christmas? Absolutely. Are you kidding? I mean, I think every year we wish for a white Christmas, and, you know, some years we're lucky. Um, it's been beautiful. We've already got some skiing in, which has been great. Um, yeah, I mean, what, what more could you ask for? I mean, Florida, you don't have a white Christmas. I feel bad for Floridians, yeah. you know. Yeah. It's unfortunate. I mean, my heart goes out to them. In the 75 degree weather on Christmas? Yeah. Oh. Yep. I know you and your sister Heather are pretty close. Do you think it's going to be hard to have your Christmas without her this year? You know, my sister and I don't need to be in the same area to, you know, celebrate Christmas together. We can Skype and she understands that, you know, I need to be home for, for the job and, and, you know, I love her to death. I uh, I think of her often, but I mean, I have a pretty thick skin, Nick. Yeah. <laughs> I'm I'm not gonna let I'm not gonna let those tears overcome me. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm I'm pretty pretty thick skinned. So. Sounds good. Cheers to that. Cheers. The cashier was like, looks at me, and she goes, "I like your coat." It just started like bawling, <laughs> making her really uncomfortable on the shore. But like, Heather, you got me this coat on Christmas. <laughs> Heather. I'm sorry. <sighs> Next year we'll be together, I promise. I won't miss it for the world. You be the world to me. Mom. 
I love you so much. You're the best mother I could ever ask for. You've done so much for me and made me the person I am. Grammy. <laughs> so much. You've taught me all the important things about being respectful, being a lady. I think about you so many times in life when I'm proper and when, you know, I look at people and I can see that they respect me and I think it's a lot due to the respect I have for myself because you've always shown me what it is to be a woman and to always respect myself and never jeopardize my morals and Bob. I don't tell you enough, but I adore you. I love you so much. <laughs> You've been the man in my life that nobody else could be. <laughs> I can't thank you enough for the lessons you taught me and for listening to me <laughs> when, <laughs> when I needed a man to listen to me. I love you all, and I'm sorry this is so emotional, <laughs> but you four mean the most to me out of anyone else. You're irreplaceable. I love you. Merry Christmas. Jack Frost nipping at your nose Yuletide carols being sung by a choir Will make it hard to sleep tonight They know that Santa's on his way He's loaded lots of toys and goodies on his and every mother's child is gonna spy to see if reindeer really know how to fly. And so I'm offering this simple phrase to kids from one to ninety-two. Although it's been said many times, many 